Hi, welcome to Daily Net, where dreams begin. A period drama starring China's top actor Xiao Zhan has finally broadcast on CCTV. Whether it's TV ratings or internet popularity, it's safe to say that it's at its pinnacle and has gotten an overwhelming five-star rating on Duban. Where Dreams Begin centers on the main character Xiao Chunsheng, as well as his two companions Ye Guo Hua and Chen Hong Jun, who are the offspring of a military and government worker family who grew up together. They share various experiences together, such as joining the army, picking up Gao Cao, going to sea, and starting a business, while supporting each other along the way. They also meet Tang Xiaomei, a Beijing girl who wants to be a doctor. This is an uplifting story about regular people's growth and transformation during the reform era of 1970s China, when the country opened up to the rest of the world. The background and family relationships of Xiao Chunsheng's character, played by Xiao Zhan, are clearly told in the first four episodes, indicating that while he is usually big-hearted, when something does happen, he has a subtle mind and considers the overall situation, implying that he will be a person who does great things in the future. In addition, Xiao Zhan's emotive lines are captivating. Specifically, the process of getting to know and falling in love with first love Ha Hongling, played by Chao Feron. It also makes viewers eager to see how he develops with his life partner Tong Xiaomei, played by Li Qin, later on. Furthermore, Xiao Zhan's appearance is regarded to complement the whole role he plays. It was tough for his to speak Beijing dialect as a Chongqing native, but he did it. On the other side, popular actress Dilaraba Dilmarat's latest drama, Prosecution Elite, has received both positive and negative reactions. Despite being the first prosecutor's subject from a woman's point of view in China, the plot lacked a sense of reality regardless of how cases were handled, hence ratings were lower than expected. This was the first time a crime investigation drama starring Dilaraba was shown, and it drew a lot of attention before the drama aired. Many people believe she can exploit this drama to advance her career as an actress. However, after it was officially broadcast, although Dilaraba's original dialogue was clear, the plot of her speech also had a strong meaning, even though the dialogue was too difficult. Many commented that the story in the drama was not close to real life, so only four episodes were aired and netizens yelled to leave the drama, saying that they couldn't watch it at all. On the other hand, the plot of Prosecution Elite drew a lot of concern from the outside world. After the drama aired, they remarked that it reminded them of a criminal investigation drama from 20 years ago. The older sister of Zhang Wanru's character delved deep into the criminal group as a secret agent, believing she had discovered evidence of a crime, but it was a game of chess played by a high-level criminal group. And eventually, Zhang Wanru, played by Jia Qing, disclosed her identity and died in front of Ani. The plot as a whole is nothing new. Netizens argue that the story of Zhang Wanru's death in the line of duty may be told in a few minutes rather than a full episode of acting that has no real value to the plot. Meanwhile, Dilaraba Dolmarat does not dispute that, while the initial vocal line was difficult for her, the most difficult aspect of the part was working with so many seniors. She stated that she couldn't identify the role's direction at first, and that it wasn't until she discussed it with the director and communicated with the prosecutor that she realized how to interpret it. Drama fans believe that Dilaraba's speech in the first few episodes is much more mature and stable than in the past, and they expect that the plot of the drama prosecution elite will progressively improve so that it may be enjoyed. Following that, the popularity of Here We Meet Again, starring Zhang Binbin and Wu Qian, skyrocketed, and the drama's rating surpassed Gen Z, starring Zhao Lucy and Prosecution Elite, starring Dilaraba Dilmarat. Many netizens complimented Zhang Binbin and Wu Qian's kiss moment in Here We Meet Again for making them numb. This drama follows Shang Yuan, played by Wu Qian, the eldest daughter of the Donghe family, who is tasked with preserving their Xi'an branch from bankruptcy. This is when she runs across her old flame Suyanxi again. Shang Yuan pursued Suyanxi with all her might during their school days but to no avail. Reunited as adults, she is attempting to save a firm while he is mired in muck owing to workplace troubles. Despite the obstacles, she is determined to follow his dream of becoming a navigation engineer. Shang Yuan progressively learns to take issues into her own hands as she deals with the company problem. The two meet to support one another as they pursue their aspirations. In addition to Zhang Binbin and Wu Qian, Shi Qingyan, Liu Yuthing, Wang Dei, Sha Royan, and others appeared in this drama. The drama is available on Tencent Video every day. Next, the cast for the upcoming Shenxia drama, Si Hai Zhangming, starring Zhang Lingha and Jing Tian, has now been officially unveiled. 
Aside from Zhang Lingha and Jing Tian, the key roles in this drama will be played by Darren Chen and Chong Long. Chao Zhenyu, Fan Ming, Huang Haibin and Ling Meishi will appear as supporting characters, with special appearances by Liu Lingzi, Chao Shi Yue, and others. Adapted on Yi Daishui's novel Woyasan Jilong Aotian Juma and co-produced by Dao Film and Straw Bear. This drama is about a woman named Nan Yan, played by Jing Tian, who unintentionally installs a concentric lock to break her marriage to Emperor Ji Yong, played by Zhang Lingha. Nan Yan considered Ji Yan's monarch to be cold, hypocritical, and haughty. In her quest to discover the truth about her mother's heart ailment, she unintentionally becomes entangled in the fairy world's biggest conspiracy. There is no other information about this drama yet, however it is planned to be 24 episodes long and to debut in 2024. Furthermore, the cast of the historical drama Northwards has been officially confirmed, with Bai Lu and Oh Hao playing the lead roles. This drama is expected to be the next a lifelong journey and a smash hit. The production staff and screenwriters are at the top of their game. Adapted on Xu Jie Chen's novel, Bei Shang. The novel is about a Suzhou boatman who has always wanted to own his own boat and run the canals. This was also a long-cherished wish of his family's five generations. He was compelled to use a hired boat to convey Italian passengers to Beijing to find relatives in order to obtain a boat, but his goal was crushed when there was a riot in Beijing. The plot in this novel continues for several generations, until the boat driver's great-grandson returns to his village to mend his wounds after suffering a major setback. He met a female painter who had come to submit work for a thousand miles of canals. Finally, they agreed to collaborate on a large-scale live production called A Thousand Miles of Canal Map to recreate the beauty of the Grand Canal, paying honor to history, the present, and the future. This drama will also feature Qi Shang, Gao Jeting, Chu Xuan Zhang, Li Wanda, and a variety of other senior actors in addition to Bai Lu and Oh Hao. On June 2nd, the beautiful actress Angela Baby's name was once again dragged into the dating news by the Chinese gossip media. They broke the story about the purported romance of Yang Ying, a new starlet. Huang Xiaoming's ex-wife was spotted partying with her friends, according to paparazzi media. However, after the party, she and a mysterious man went to eat hot pot alone, away from her companions. Angela Baby is known to have returned with the man to her house, where the two are supposed to have lived together. While Angela Baby was at work, the man was said to be returning to his house after having lunch with her driver. The gossip media also stated that the man who threw Angela Baby's birthday party was someone from outside the entertainment world. However, Angela Baby's management has yet to reply to the dating rumors. What do you think? Thank you for watching. Please leave your thoughts in the comments section and see you in the next video.